Hey, welcome uh, back. My name is Teresa, and I am very much alive, and I have a beautiful co-host here. All right. Uh, <laughs> I have an awful garbage, filthy mouth where sometimes, just sometimes, not all the time, but sometimes, uh, really, it's probably all the time, I tend to use the word fuck as a comma. I know, it's disgusting, I should be stopped, but I'm here, you're here. Let's just get down to it. Get dirty. Yes. All right. That <laughs> makes me feel very happy. <laughs> if you're not into that or weird stuff in general, then this is definitely not the place for you. Feel free to X out the video here. No harm, no foul. But I'll remember our time fondly. Click. So I hear you like makeup. Yeah. Let's go talk about some holiday sets. And you know what? Ulta, I think it's somehow worse, perhaps. I can't wait for that. <laughs> what we're going to do is we're going to go to new arrivals. We're going to go to makeup. We're gonna go here, but we are going to go to, should we do gift and value sets? Yeah. Oh. No, I already see that one. Are you kidding me? <laughs> I remember when you showed me that. Just click it, just fucking click in. Uh, All right, who is this for? <laughs> who is this for? What is this? <laughs> I like hot sauce. I'm a hot sauce boy. The tapatio is good. Um, I like Cholula more. It has better flavor. If this was a Cholula set, I would fucking get it. Yeah. So that's actually the only hot sauce Teresa fucks with as well. I know. I saw a lot of people that were like, oh my god, they made this for me. Like, really? Are you like, hey, I'm going to put saucy on the inner eye. I'm going to put And then tap, tap that. Oh, I'm Fucking come on. I'm cringing from how disgusting tap that. Ew. Would Mr. Tapatio be okay with this? Look at him. Yeah. I'm pretty. Well, I think I mean, he's he looks, dead. He looks happy. <laughs> Is he really a thing? I have no idea. Someone can someone fact check this to see if if he actually was a thing. Yes, instead of googling ourselves, <laughs> tell them to hey, that thing we just said, Google it and let us know in the comments. Can you fact check? Because I'm pretty sure this man, if he did exist, is rolling around in his grave. Do you think his tombstone is a bottle of tapatio? Oh, if it's not, I'd be pissed. I'd be fucking <laughs> furious. <laughs> I don't even think it's a, I think it's an actual fucking mausoleum. So basically what you get is six high, high payoff shades that are soft and buttery and bright and neutrals. They have matte, matte sparkles, which if you get a matte sparkle, it essentially means bullshit. Okay. Because that shade is like, oh, you use that shade? to like blend out shades that are kind of hard. And then you might get a pop of sparkle in there. It's probably really not what it's defined as, yeah. but that's kind of how, how I see, see it. it. And I blame that because of the Tati palette. Hey, you use these when my other shades in the palette suck and they don't work for you, then use this, boo. Yeah. So that's kind of what it is. But Why make one shade that works? when you can have another shade in the palette that fixes the other shade. Exactly. Dumb. <laughs> it's called makeup. And then you have this one that's a glitter. It's called flame, though. That's fun. <sighs> oh, they're pressed glitters? Get the fuck out of here. I would never get it just purely based on the fact that they're pressed I would glitters. only be interested if it smelt like tapatio. If this actually smells like hot sauce, I would buy it and put it on your face because this would totally burn my fucking eyeballs oh, out. Oh, 100%. But I would totally put it on your face just for a video. But it's got fun names, like... Tap that? Go down. Caliente. <laughs> I think you're going to say sizzle. <laughs> <laughs> Who the fuck is this for? <laughs> Who the fuck is this for? All right, this is not Let holiday. us know if this is for you. <laughs> Let us know. Mac has a whole collection. Like, they have a bunch of little shits, but... A bunch of little shits? Eh, essentially. I'm even bored just even saying that. <laughs> this oh, is God. What is that? <laughs> That's not glitter. No. No, that's like that. That's fucking Gandalf's pubes. <laughs> I was actually going to take this back to like a time where you get that sweater from the, your one relative and it's made of that really kind of scratchy oh, fucking Oh, super material. scratchy one. And then they're like, oh, just put it in the wash. It'll and it'll get softer. No. And you put it in the wash and the hair attaches to literally everything in the washer. Yes. Cool. Bag is fucking hideous. Who? Oh, oh, God. It's... it's so offensive it's this is a thing that will come alive in the middle of the night and fucking sit on top of your face to strangle you or try to get into your mouth and ultimately body snatch you yeah just like gandalf's pubes oh come on what <laughs> <laughs> i mean you're not wrong but no i mean what the fuck do you get with us you get lip gloss like i said i'm not really too excited about mac stuff i could kind of care less i think this bag is the most offensive thing and look how fucking oh, cheap God. it looks. It looks like a nightmare. It's like Easter grass. It's the Easter grass It of, wishes of... it was Easter grass. You know they make edible Easter grass? So you can yes, I heard that. eat it, bro. Why? Oh, so you don't you find eat... it three years later behind your couch? Well, you still could, oh, but... Gross. I 
can't You can load your basket with candies and just fucking chow down on the hair, bro. What is this? I have no idea. <laughs> that's what that is. All right. This one. Is that big different? This one's different. This one's Oh, like, that's just I'm a firework BB. That's what this oh, is. Okay. This is a Katy Perry. Channeling Katy Perry circa whenever that song came out. Exactly. Cool. <laughs> Flash it on the screen. <laughs> <laughs> but this one, though, you get brushes. That's not bad. I've heard, I, I've heard, I've heard, I've heard, I too declare these I, brushes. <laughs> well, I say, I say, I, I say, boy, I heard these brushes are great. I, I actually heard Mac brushes are fantastic. I don't own any Mac oh. brushes. I think out of all the, the stuff, maybe this is probably the, the best option. For, especially if you like their brushes or if you wanted to try their brushes like that's not bad i don't know what that little like jellyfish dick is <laughs> um it, you know it's anyway so i actually don't mind this this is the least offensive out of all the max yeah, stuff the, i think the bags. I, I could fuck with that everything else man i don't know what that eh, nightmare pubes is eh. though get that out of here that i mean yeah these things are fucking terrible oh and then you have like this what thing what is that first of all does it come with what is this you know what this reminds me of oh my god uh the fuck is that game? Hey, we could get in trouble. Yeah, it might get in trouble. Yeah. It might get in trouble. Also, I mean, it comes with a little display. I mean, that's cute. Yeah, like that's not bad. If you like Mac lipsticks, I guess. I like some of the colors, but not all of them. Ooh, I kind of like that orange shade. But yeah, I mean, this is cute. This isn't bad. Yeah, I mean, if, if you like trouble, seventy four dollars. If hey, if you get twelve and. A trouble middle piece, okay? Those are hard to come by these days. All right, I mean, I can fuck with that. Be between the trouble piece and this thing, these two it's monsters better, we gotta kill, but yeah. these two are fine. You gotta take those out back and shoot before it takes over the whole town. Oh. Oh, yes. These are the best. <laughs> Just when you thought it couldn't get And worse. it's only $13. What is happening? Oh, my God. First of all, I don't think this is I a holiday one. I didn't though. know Mac made Transformers. First of all, this isn't Mac. <laughs> oh, it's not? <laughs> Damn it. No, this is Beauty Gems. Who the hell is Beauty Gems? Um, they're a gem. Oh, tight. <laughs> they're a gem and they enjoy beauty. Well, Transformer this? much? Oh. Are they going to get the All Spark? Like. Optimus Prime. Yeah, not a fan of that. Oh, I That's... love the little fat hands, though. Actually, is that a dick? If you really thought about it, here you have your little fat hand. You have your little haunch here. You got your dick, haunch, hand, your body. There's a lot going on in that. And for $13, when I see something like that, like there's no way all of that could be like good quality. Oh, no, no. it's It never is. Okay. That's a So I Hear You Like Makeup. So I Hear You Like Makeup. Two. Here's everything. By the way, here's a little deck too for you. Hmm. Also, you don't really know what you get in here. Yeah, that the description is really killing it. It just says you can create a full face of custom looks. But can you though? It's but isn't really every fashion. look a custom look? Yes. In Techni theory. If you want to get technical about yeah, it. Yeah, every look you create is custom. Yeah, everything. Now Ulta has like their own line of stuff. So like Sephora, like the cheetah thing. Oh yeah, Mr. So fucking Cheetah. Ulta has their own beauty line. Which Is they... it like a tortoise or something? <laughs> it could be. Hold on, there's so many. I mean, it is a library. I'm fucking bored. Wow. <laughs> Reading what? I'm sorry, it's a library. Keep it down. First of all, it's really hard to tell what kind of color lipsticks you're getting in this. Oh, okay. So it just tells you at the end. <laughs> I mean, the details actually have details. That's fun. I'm going to say no to this because this doesn't look appetizing. You're not supposed to eat it. Oh. Well. What the fuck are we doing then? <laughs> I, I never know, man. <laughs> the lipstick library. Shh. It's now closed. <laughs> it's okay. <laughs> Get out of here. <laughs> so then we have the pretty pout. No, pretty little pout kit. That seems like big packaging for little teeny tiny things. Well, yeah. You could fucking put two of them, especially in the bottom Are you kidding? One. Side it's... You can squeeze three in. Get the fuck out of here. Actually, it's kind of funny because each one is perfect and that obviously And that fell. last one. They were so lazy. They were like, let's not even open up the packaging. Let's just show them how you're really going to get Like, this. this is what it's really going to look like. Yeah. Like, I mean, oh, no. This is Instagram that. reality. Go to the right. Instagram. Go to the left. Reality. <laughs> <laughs> so, moving on to that. Then you have this lip glossary kit because oh. we're gonna keep in the theme of libraries. Oh, shh. And back to school. Shh. Back to school was canceled. Oh, that's true. It's online, bro. These are 
kyber crystals? It looks like they're... <laughs> I feel like the lip glossary doesn't really match the packaging. I think it's more of a library than a glossary. <laughs> this should have been the library. Yeah. That one should have been the glossary or the thesaurus. The thesaurusery. The thesaurus. The thesaurusery. <laughs> I the really, sorcery is I this. I really pronounced that hard. <laughs> <laughs> like, you know, thesaurus, but I was like, thesaurus. <laughs> I love when that happens. For I, me. Uh, I know. Words are hard. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to say no to this. Why, you don't need 16 lip glosses? <laughs> are these for giving away too? Does it say it in the description? No, it's a collection. This is, this is, oh, no. actually it's not all lip glosses. You have lip oils, lip glosses, liquid lipsticks. Oh, four, four mat and four patent. Okay. Is it like patent pending? <laughs> That's what this all feels like. Is <laughs> I don't know. That's weird. Okay. I think out of all the lip sets, this is probably the one that makes the most sense because you get a lip liner and a liquid lipstick and it seems like the colors go together very yeah. well. I think out of all the lip products, this is probably the least offensive, but again, I'm getting tripped up on the fucking IP over here. Like it's <laughs> stupid. But yeah, anyway, Ulta has all this bullshit. And now <laughs> we have, okay, first of all, let's fucking talk about this shit. This, this pisses me off. This is Anastasia Beverly Hills. Basically to give you a backstory, Alex, they came out with the soft glam palette mm -hmm. and essentially I would say 80% of the shades are from the soft glam palette and there are two shades that are so new. So six shades are the same. Yes. Two are newsies. Hence 80, 20. Yes. Thank you. <laughs> but at first I was like, how the fuck are you going to call this a sequel until I realized that there were two new shades? And I was like, oh, that's how you're going to get away with that. I don't know. I feel like the sequel would have a little of the last thing and more new, like any sequel of a movie, let's say. Okay. Like, I could agree to that. You know, to keep two, keep maybe like the two most popular ones and then do six new ones. Yeah. Instead of you keep six of the old ones and then do two new ones. Exactly. I think it's just so dumb. What are they going to do for three? Keep one? I mean, get one new one. For the fourth one, it's going to be a reboot, but it's going to be a reboot of the same exact palette. <laughs> Except the outside packaging is going to be a slightly different color, but it's going to be the same shades. Perfect. That's what I mean, number that's, four is going to be. <laughs> what else would it be? Exactly. But this is $29. See, isn't that kind of fucked up? That's weird. Yeah. I don't like that. That seems like a mini. Like, it should be a mini. Like, hey, we, yeah. we put two new ones in. Yeah. And we kept some of the oldies. Right. Call it a like fucking mini. Like the most mini. popular or Don't whatever. call it a two. Yeah. Call it a mini. I think if you really were interested in getting this palette, like just, just fucking get, get, get the, the first one. Get the first one. First one's fantastic. It's a, it's a good palette. And ABH uh, quality is good. There's nothing wrong with it. But for this, it's like I'd rather just spend the $45 getting the whole palette you might as if well. you don't have it yeah if you already do have this and you're buying this just for two shades get the fuck out of here and this is coming from me someone who's a monster you are I'm a monster like, no that's bullshit cool it's not worth it i don't think no yeah. not for two pass nyx has a bunch of bullshit which oh you we... know nyx <laughs> you know my friend nyx they always have legitimately the same holiday shit. I mean, if, if it sells. You're out. Wait, there's so much more too. To if it, it ain't broke, don't fix it. So you have this, which is fine. But for $30, though. But it's know. a $40 value. <laughs> Definitely paying for this fucking disgusting box. <laughs> for People sure. People love diamonds for some reason. <laughs> hate it i don't fucking get it this is basically for 50 bucks this is a butter gloss vault sorry what is the name diamond and ice please why or is it diamond and ice please or is it diamond and ice please diamond and ice please <laughs> actually now what is it is it diamond i, th I think it's diamond like diamond and ice please i think it's like that you're like you're ordering Hi, I'll have the diamond and ice. Please. We'll, the, we'll start off with the diamond and ice, please. <laughs> or is there like a little bit of an like an attitude in there? Like diamond ice, please. Oh no, I think it's say diamonds and ice. Diamonds and ice, please. <laughs> I think it's that. <laughs> <laughs> I'm glad we're workshopping this out loud for literally nobody. <laughs> Nick, this is for you. All right, so fifty dollars, you get this shit. The bottom swatches. What happened to the bottom one? What happened? The glosses on the person that has like the deeper complexion, they, it just it doesn't look good. Like the, the quality of the glosses look yeah, oddly doesn't, kind it doesn't of look as good. patchy. There looks like there's some like dry bits actually between the medium and the deep. Looks like it's actually smiling within the lips. Yeah. That's strange. Know, it's very strange. It's so weird. Then you, this is the what stupidest is fucking thing. Oh, it's an iPhone calendar. Get it. No. 
They show you everything. <laughs> Why would you buy it? Well, that was the thing. That's the fucking thing is that these advent calendars, they are no longer a surprise anymore. Why? That not that the point of it? That's what I thought too, but sometimes people, I guess, want to know what's in it. I get wanting to know, but... $55, though, is a fucking, like, that's fucked up. For this, all this shit, like, you're getting sample sizes of stuff. Like, you're not even getting, like, a fucking full size of things. But there's diamonds and ice, please. For $55, you're getting fucking this shit? Get the fuck out of here. You don't need that. But I guess my issue is, like, one, you're taking the fun out of it of yeah. knowing what the things are. That's one. But two... You're charging how much for fucking <laughs> this bullshit? A lot of this stuff is like sample things that you probably are either probably shitty and are dried out already. Get the fuck out of here. It's amazing okay. how these brands package this shit out, but this is always every year. There's always some sort of fucking advent calendar. I just don't know what this happened to advent calendars. Like, what did you do to them? <laughs> <laughs> what did you do to them? <laughs> Very dramatic. This one, you have um, an epic... Uh, liner like another eyeliner vault which in this case to me it's so fucking overpriced don't get that what if you're a nyx loyalist oh and you're like i love evan calendars that spoil everything <laughs> I don't, i'm just gonna never let that go <laughs> i just want you to know that i know i know uh. it's just shitty it's stupid and then the last thing they have is the um soft matte lip cream vaults which i mean whatever it's 25 dollars. i just find that their prices are just so grossly overpriced like just they're so fucking expensive for what you're getting well, look at that fun packaging <laughs> you literally see all five of them and look at all that extra garbage you have to throw out god i know oh another fucking advent calendar oh, okay yes. with literally everything in the front are you kidding me <laughs> what the fuck so this is 45 dollars. this is essentially you know like That's how it comes out what it should look like not the fucking picture like bam Why? bitch just make it a gift set. <sighs> Just make it a fucking minis gift set. But because they know they can get away with $45 if they call it a fucking advent calendar. There you go, bitch. Fuck you. You know what's so funny? I feel like... All right, so some of these things are about three... Anywhere from like three to $12. Yeah, isn't Elf like stupid cheap? It's stupid cheap. 45 bucks? You know, I think this is actually pretty decent for the money. Because I think this guy is like at least eight bucks. I know this thing is $3 over here. I think their sponge is about three. So I'm kind of curious, actually. You know, and now I wonder, is, is this actually but worth $45? It doesn't say value. So no. it might be 45 on the dot. Yeah, that's actually a very good point, too. So anyway, so Elf came out with this cute set, which I actually, I don't mind it. I really wish that it was truly an advent calendar where you didn't see what you were getting. But like, at least give the outline. Like, that's fine. Yes, I but, wish it was like that. Because then you could be like, ooh, guessy game. Yeah. But, I know. Can, can you press three in chat if you're as mad as me about advent calendars? You're so mad. I'm so mad. <laughs> I don't know why. <laughs> I know. It's like kind of bullshit. I have to say, like, I, I wouldn't be upset if I got that. Okay. I wouldn't be mad. Add to bag. I'm kidding. <laughs> I'm not mad. I do own some of these things. I know you have a few of those. <laughs> yeah. So I'm just like, like the putty for me just didn't really work. I actually broke out from the putty or whatever. But the eyeshadow palette's wonderful. The sponge's pretty good. The Holy Hydration face cream is nice. The lip balms are nice. So, I mean, like, you do get a nice set. So, I actually don't mind the e.l.f. stuff. They can stay. This is the only one that gets a pass. You can get Even a pass. Even though they spoil everything. So far, I'm, like, not... Like, it's kind of gross. Like, I'm not really fucking loving any of this shit. All the Lancome stuff is putting me to sleep as soon as I fucking look at it. Like, I don't even want to bother. Ooh, this little fucking backpack. Like, really, who the fuck are you just going to take this backpack? Outside. To the dumpster and throw it in. Juicy tubes. Ugh. Ugh. Well, that just sounds disgusting. Juicy tubes. <laughs> Ew. Ew. <laughs> <laughs> it sounds like something. That yeah, you don't have to finish that. Sentence. I'm gonna get it's a text okay. message about it. So I'm like, no. Come over here for some juicy tubes. <laughs> hey, girl, you up? I got some juicy tubes. <laughs> Yeah. Oh, gross. You know what? Actually, let me know down in in <laughs> below in the comments if you have <laughs> if if you're currently single and someone has ever said, "Hey, girl, come over here for some juicy tubes." Or if someone said juicy tubes, you'd be like, "Yes." <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I actually, don't mind a little juicy tube every now and again. But apparently, you get like this little shitty cheap fucking backpack. Is that clear? That's a clear backpack because uh, I yikes. mean, I I'm pretty sure it's it clear. Looks yeah, it. it is clear. Look at it. Ugh. Stupid clear backpack. So you can see all the juicy tubes. Yeah, in it. 
Oh, get the fuck out of here. What is this? First of all, this died in the 90s. Let it fucking stay dead. Mm -mm. No, I hate this. I hate the clear trend coming back. I hate it. It's fucking dumb. So stupid. <laughs> so stupid. I hate it. The $46 value? But you get it for 25 bucks. Yay! Yeah. <laughs> Where's the holiday shit? This is the holiday shit. Bull so some of it's like mixed shit. in there. Oh, It Cosmetics. Can I tell you? It Cosmetics usually comes out with like some sort of holiday bundle or like holiday eyeshadow palette that is the most basic, disgusting thing possible and I love you it. I love it. I like it's a the most shameful thing I have in my collection. It's disgusting, but I love it though. <laughs> and I don't think they came out with a palette this year, so I can't, you know, get my own Yeah. <laughs> but say something really gross. Can't get your it fuck on. I can't get my it fuck on. But now I have like this stuff, which I'm kind of like not into. No, that's not what you want. This is the Celebrate Your Beauty makeup set. Also, just a fun fact, if you ever want to get anything from It Cosmetics, just go on their website. Every time I go on their website, they always fucking throw out coupons at me that are like, save $20, save this, save that. So if you're looking for any sort of holiday set, I recommend going going to their site directly instead of Ulta. But anyway. It's a $100 value? Yeah, apparently. Huh? How is that a hundred dollars? Is the brush like ninety dollars? Their brushes are normally pretty expensive. Okay. Yeah. So. Say, it looks like one of those brushes. It's like this brush is three hundred dollars, made from unicorn hair. <laughs> I wish I had a brush made from <laughs> unicorn hair. Ulta pretty much is jumping on the bandwagon of like Sephora favorites, and <laughs> they have a little set of like you can get all these things, which majority of this stuff is things that you already have because you get free. Yeah, like, like sample with, sizes. Give with purchase. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the, obviously the the big price point is the Kylie one in the middle because that's fucking yeah. front and center. I know her lip stuff is not bad. Like I actually have a couple of her things, but I think her brand overall is just overrated. But that's just me. Well, yeah, she, so are all of them. Oh yeah, like this... Nars Orgasm Blush. Like I mean, come on, get the fuck out of here. Like what? What is all this? What is? What is? This? What is this? Who is this for? They have a lash one as well as a lip one. So the lash one, you're basically getting. Um, ugh, God, these are so boring. <laughs> ugh. What's nice about this is that you do get a five dollar gift card, and I'm assuming, which they don't fucking tell you, but I'm assuming if you like one of these guys. You can probably use that five dollar gift card to purchase to a big one. version. Yeah, no, that makes. Sense. And Sephora used to do that, and I think they stopped doing that. Really? So I'm kind of glad that Ulta at least has that option because that's really nice. That's what kind of no, makes this work. That's it. a good idea. Yeah. Like, do a sample kit, give you a reason, like incentive, to buy a full version of the, one of the products you just tried. Amen. And same thing for their lip set. They have like a bunch of different lip things that you can try, and then essentially there's your five dollar gift card to uh, purchase probably one of these items in the full size line, which is really fucking cool. So that's nice. And I also like that it's marketed as a sampler kit. Same thing over here, right? Yep, five bucks off. Yep. Yep. Um, yeah, I think that's probably the best part about those is that there is an incentive. Yeah, no, that makes sense. Yeah. Blah, blah, blah. Ugh, Bare Minerals is so sleepy. I can't even. <laughs> I'm so sleepy looking at this shit. It's so sleepy. It's so sleepy. Ugh. We had enough benefit last time. Oh, yes, we did. Fuck that. So let's end it with some Too Faced Two -faced Magic. Too Faced Finale. This one I haven't fucking seen. This is a new one. The this is, is the Sugar Plum Fun. Hi. Perfectly splendid. Stop it. <laughs> Stop. Perfectly splendid like everything else. I hate this. I hate the palette is like boring. Bleh. Oh my god. Go back to the one. Go back to the colors again. Yeah. I thought it said. Go ahead, left a little. I thought it said babes in Toyota Land. <laughs> <laughs> have you like, ever never seen babes? I'm sorry. <laughs> have you never seen babes in Toyota? I have not. <laughs> it's so much fun. Okay, so this is awful. Not really a fan of any of this shit. Mm -hmm. No, no, no. Um, and then you get their primer, which their primer is nothing amazing. But you also get this little tiny <laughs> <laughs> little lip injection with all the sparklies. I don't like this set. It's thirty. Hundred and five dollars. Who the fuck are you marking this up to? Like that that's crazy. Is this eyeshadow palette made of gold? I look at all the gold flakes in Toyota Land. <laughs> I love gold in Toyota Land. <laughs> this is so stupid. This palette on a good day would be fifteen bucks. On a good day. 
Starbucks. <laughs> you know, and then you're going to pa- Are these even full size staff? No, it's a deluxe. Uh, so wait, the, and then the, a travel the, size. So the deluxe might be full or regular. No, I. So here's the thing. It's it's either two things because there's also deluxe sample size. Oh my! Are you fucking serious? Mm-hmm. So I don't know if that's a deluxe sample size mm-hmm. or if that's like a truly actual full size. But mm-hmm. regardless, though, like their fucking primer is not amazing. Yeah. Like who the fuck do you think you are? Get the fuck out of here. That's the kind of shit that when you're in like a DSW and you see yeah. some sort of leather keychain that's like, this is three thousand dollars, but look, Roseanne, I could get it for ten. Like that's what or that is. Or in every Marshalls or TJ Maxx. Yes. We're like, this was normally eighty nine thousand dollars, and I'm gonna get it for fourteen seventy five. <laughs> I, love I don't know these characters. I was like, who is this little old man I'm talking to? I have no to? idea, but he's very happy to get a deal. <laughs> Listen, I was like, I'm looking into my future. <laughs> I love it. I say no. This is a big old no. Fuck you. So then you have a little... What is this? What is this? Now that's a fucking claim in the title. The greatest mascara of all of time. all time. Perfectly splendid. This actually looks terrifying. I would not for why why does it look like her lashes Spider are lashes. windstorm? Spiders. Oh my god. She's like, hey, I have normal lashes. Oh no, I did my mascara during a fucking tornado. Yeah. <laughs> That's why they're like this. No. I right when the F five touches down, I'm like, <laughs> I gotta hit that scara. Uh, get it on my eye holes. I don't like any of this. I also don't like that it's so Ugh Get that looks so crunchy. That's crunchy. That is so crunchy. It is very crunchy. It's, you, it mm. looks like it's made of... Oh my god. That is that is just nightmares. It uh, looks like it's made of, like, glass. <laughs> yes. Like, it's hard. Like, yes. if you touched it, it it's would, gonna, like... Psh- it would stab your head. Like, oh god, I got a cut. That's exactly what it's gonna do. Fuck that shit. Um, question. Yeah. The... Everything... Okay, so go back to the first... The tubes. Yeah. Okay, so my question is... The whole... Sex thing? Yeah. With makeup? Yeah. To me, that feels like the makeup version of, like, the Mountain Dew, punch yourself in the dick, like, men, boy version of, like, any of that stuff. Yeah. It's just that for, like, why does that exist? This is a mascara for, like, women that read Cosmo that can't make life choices, so they they pretty much (laughs) take a quiz in the back of a Uh, fucking magazine. To see if they're compatible with their boyfriend and then they break up. Is he really cheating on me? (laughs) With zero evidence, it's just a quiz. <laughs> That's what when it I look just, at this it just stuff. It seems so stupid. But this is also marketed towards younger women. I, which is like even weirder. Even then, because like, there's like kids, and I mean like kids like under eighteen that are like like getting uh, two faced yeah, up. It's no, weird. It's like overly sexual to kids, and you're like, nah, bro. I mean, nah. I know I get that like tons of things, and like marketing is like hyper sexualized. Yeah. Because for some reason, sex sells. I yes. don't get it. I mean, when I want mascara, I think of big old titties. <laughs> <laughs> Bigger the titties, I mean, the closer the lash. What I else? Don't be- <laughs> what does that mean? It's terrible. I don't. I don't get it. Nobody gets it. Nobody gets it. I feel like people like it though. People love it because they it, want to be told what to do. They want to be told that they should wear this oh, sexy mascara so for heads their heads up to all the sheeple out there. I know for their significant others, so their significant others could not care two shits what their fucking mascara looks like because they're probably not fucking them anyway. Or you could just get someone that like genuinely likes you. That's asking instead of for settling. too much. <laughs> That's the problem with the, I think the world today. People just settle. Mm, half point I had to make about that. Yeah, no, I got it. I got it. It, it just gets worse though for them. Um, so this is the Christmas No, sad, not the pets again. <laughs> the Christmas sad animals. You get the palette and mm-hmm. then you get like these two. You get a better than sex mascara, a little boy. Ugh. And then you get like a little lip injection, which essentially is like their plumping lip gloss. That's the one that like numbs your mouth, right? Yeah, because it gives you that DSL. If you don't know what that means, it means dick sucking lips for all you... <sighs> people out there that didn't know what DSL meant and didn't want to Google it. Anyways, that's essentially what the set is. I thought you said DHL and they were going to deliver you something. <laughs> <laughs> so anyway, you have the enchanted forest makeup because it's perfectly <laughs> splendid. I hate this. I hate it. I don't, I don't get it. Like, go back to the bunny. Yeah. Like, why? Girl. What's up with that? 205. Wow. Yeah. They really fucking they mark their shit reaching. up. It's terrible. Especially when their eyeshadow palettes are about $49. 
Oh, did they go for like full TJ Maxx with that? Yes. Like, was $900, you get it for 12 Exactly. So you get a bronzer, you get two kinds of blushes, and I believe just one highlighter. It's like a weird universal palette that's not quite universal. I don't know, like, I just, it's... It doesn't look universal. Yeah, but it's kind of like how they fucking package everything as. And yeah. also this one shade over here, the... Oh, what the fuck is it? Snow Fake Friends or some shit like that? I'm sorry, what? <laughs> I think it's called Snow Fake Friends. The one silver one? Yeah, uh, yeah, like the silver one. Oh, okay, It's yeah. in every holiday palette. Like, that's the one shade that they always have a repeat of. But they love Snowflake Friends. <laughs> we love Snowflake Friends. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, this to me is fucking stupid. Don't even bother. Yeah, like, then what, you have... What is this? This is the Better Than Sex Vault. Of course it is. So for $78, you can get a uh, whopping five mascaras. $130 value, really? Yeah. You can get spider eyes like that lady. This, to me, this only makes sense if... If you truly fucking love the mascara and... You just want to stock up on it? Yeah. That's the only thing Doesn't that, it, like, go bad, though? If you open it. Okay. Yeah. So if, if, it's sealed, it. if it's sealed, it holds. Okay. Yeah. That makes sense. Each mascara, I think, usually has, like, a shelf life of about six months. Okay. Three to six, once, depending once on... Once you crack it? Yeah. Okay. So, I mean, this is actually probably the best value if you like that mascara, but that mascara sucks, in my opinion. But it's better than Sam. <sighs> Here we go. Oh, what is this? This is the Christmas Snuggles and Melted Kisses Liquid Lipstick Set. So basically, you get... Christmas this. Snuggles. <laughs> and this is supposed to smell like a hot toddy. Okay. So, okay. Can continue. Okay. Go through all the smells first. I have a lot to say already. <laughs> Candy cane, sugar cookie, and then you have a caramel apple. Okay. Um, I'm going to stop at the bear. Go ahead. All right. A question for you. <laughs> yeah. Shoot. So the rest of them t smell like, you know, fun, common holiday ingredients. Yes. Sweet, mostly. Yes. Why the fuck would you want one to smell like your drunk mom? I think in the same age when you... Why? When you... <laughs> When you can't visit your relatives. This one, this one smells like grandma. <laughs> like, come on. Sometimes. That is such a jump. How do you go from sweet treats to fucking alcoholic family member? What is happening? I, and why is it a precious bear holding a fucking hot toddy? First of all. Even though it's in Long Island iced tea. I was just say, <laughs> that bear is holding a Long Island iced tea. I know it. You drink it. that shit out of a mug? I so <laughs> no one can see what you're drinking, even though everyone smells it. <laughs> exactly. I was actually very confused on why he was drinking a Long Island iced tea. I was like, all right, <laughs> that's weird. I agree with you, but I, I think, though, that because this is going to be the, you know, basically the holiday Zoom year. Yeah. That they're going to be like, you, this is, you're going to take out this lipstick. You're going to put it on to remind you of your mom mm. or, or your drunk aunt. You're like thinking of you, Who wants to tell Granny. you about weird racist stuff. Yeah. <laughs> who would say things you'd be like, I think she's racist. I think she's racist. <laughs> like, mm -hmm. But then you're like, the ham's good. So you go back. You go back every year for that ham. That's essentially what the set is. <sighs> Racist family that members and all. It's just like... <laughs> it's stupid. That... Actually, no, I take it back. It's not stupid because product-wise, like, these boys are good. Like, okay. I actually I actually don't mind them. And I got last year's set, and the set was pretty good. Was there a hot toddy in that set? No, there was, like, a butter spice rum. Oh, wow. Well. So Al it, there's always, there's an always al an alcohol? Yes, because you always have that drunk-ass aunt... Uncle, mom, I could keep going. I there, know. Okay. <laughs> um, I'm gonna call it next year keg nog. Oh, it's, an, it's a keg yes. of eggnog. <laughs> if there is that, there is, I will fucking, fucking die. Send me money, okay? Yeah, two base. You send us money. <laughs> but uh, yeah, I mean, for twenty five dollars, I think this is like a nice little set. But um, yeah. Yeah, that's just I, I like don't the colors. They look good. I like them. I can fuck with it. But yeah, no, I agree. Yeah. Fucking sweet little bear. That drinking makes, a Long Island iced fucking tea. Long Island, is that how fucked up he is? That he's like, hey, I got a hot toddy, guys. <laughs> he's like, isn't this hey, summer? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> no? All right. So then you have this one. This is the Hangover Skincare Set. I haven't seen this one before. But if you like their Hangover Primer. Hangover. So they're making fun out of you know, alcoholic family members? Yeah. I've got a holiday hangover. Because <laughs> they're so relatable. I mean, maybe I like 12 years ago when things weren't more out in the open and you could joke about that. But I feel like that's just too fucking real now. Yeah, I know. It's just like... Mm, like, mm, that's mm. not it, fam. So this is $32. Apparently it's a $70 value. I laugh at that because I believe these are all pretty much motherfucking sample sizes. Yeah, but that... So you're paying for the fucking bag. You're paying for the hilarious bag. Oh, God. But then you have something like this, which is like the little gingerbread spice palette. So last two years ago, they came out with this big gingerbread palette. Last year, then they came out with the extra spicy version. 
which essentially was that first palette, but like they just added a shade, like a different kind of thing, kind of like what ABH did a little gotcha. bit. And now they're basically it. beating a dead horse by now because they're like, oh, hey, since you can't get it, we're going to sell a mini version of them, which these aren't bad for stocking stuffers, but $27 is pretty high price for a little stocking stuffer in my opinion. Yeah, but look how fun the outside is. That's one thing I will say is that their packaging kills it, but like, eh, I don't think you fucking need it, but he is adorable though. Look at him. <laughs> look at that With little... candy buttons. <laughs> <laughs> Perfectly splendid. No, I love his little candy button. My uh, candy button. I can't wait for like half the people that like watch this if yeah. they get f- this far, which oh, yeah. fucking points to you. Um, watched Haunting on Bly and are like, I fucking hate that so much. <laughs> I hope you guys do do watch it because please leave Perfectly Splendid in the comments. What oh, yeah. is this? Tell them to stop. Uh, so we got even more sadder animals can we stop this is the sarah mclaughlin of all palettes (laughs) stop because then we'll get caught oh shit yeah (laughs) (laughs) oh shit fuck no this is essentially what it is it's the same kind of palettes but it's a 240 (laughs) for 50 bucks are you fucking kidding me for 50 bucks you can get that are you fucking kidding me is their warehouse full of those oh my god Too Faced, for the last 75 years, have come out with these palettes, essentially, that you kind of get. Like, it's kind of like an eye-to-face palette. Okay. Always the same colors. Always the same. Except they just change up the packaging just a little bit. Mm. The packaging, honestly, is not even really that nice. It's like like cardboard. I don't like the... Well, I was just going to even refer to the fucking outside. I'm like, I don't don't like that. That's not... If anyone knows, uh, in Target... Where if you go to like the kids section and like the bedding, there is these stuffed animals that you could put on the wall that looks like you fucking killed a <laughs> fucking stuffed bear. It's literally and just then like mounted his head a like a stuffed deer. Stuffed head of a of a, like a teddy bear. Yeah, like it is. I'll put a picture up here. It's the most horrifying fucking thing you will ever see. And that's essentially what this is. This looks like there is some sort of serial killer that's been killing these goddamn forest animals and then he puts them on the wall and then puts like a little fucking tiara on them <laughs> and then he eats his dinner with them yeah and then he talks to his mother who's been dead for fucking 25 years that's what this collection but is but she loved hot toddies <laughs> she it would be a stuffed bear <laughs> Corner. Has a whole Long Island iced tea. <laughs> That's mom. All right, this oh, is fuck. garbage. I can't I get over $45. Yeah, I, don't, I don't like that. I don't like that. that <laughs> Nobody <line>. does. <laughs> Nobody does. This is bullshit. But yeah, that's gross. And then I think the last one we have here is essentially it's the same thing as like the little gingerbread guy. You can get a salted caramel one. Okay. Packaging is cute. Packaging is adorable. Like I'm not going to deny that. But it's just like, eh. You know, like, why aren't the pan designs exactly the same? Is it yeah. the same way on that one, too? Yeah, same Oh, thing. shit. Weird. Oh, I don't like that. Oh, that bothers me so much. Ew. Okay. Anyway, so that's this one. Again, I think if these things were, like, maybe $17, like, if they were $10 off. It'd be, like, the women. Yeah. I don't know. Also, the color story, I would never get salted caramel from the color story. All right, so I think that's pretty much it in terms of holiday stuff at Ulta. Tart has a couple of things, but we don't really give no, a fuck about Tart on this cares channel. Tart. Who cares? All right. Tart who? <laughs> who? <laughs> anyway, uh, I want to say thank you so much, Alex, for hanging out with me. Of course. I live here. <laughs> if you want to know more about Alex, you could stalk him, for one. He wouldn't mind that. Yeah. You know. We love having company. Uh, <laughs> but he has a channel. I'll link it down below. And if you want to hear more from us we have a wonderful podcast called dead and bored go check it out we're currently watching harper's, harper's island. island the fucking hit show <sighs> hit <Yeah. laughs> i would use that term loosely <laughs> hit it was a hit it was an absolute hit mm-mm, mm-mm. canceled After canceled it was a, a great show episodes. <laughs> anyways we're currently watching that as well as uh are you afraid of the dark we kind of sprinkle in there every now and again anyway yeah just want to say thank you so much for watching i truly appreciate it as always feel free to like comment hit that subscribe button it's free and hit that bell icon for notification of all my future posts follow me on twitter instagram patreon to all my beautiful wonderful patron bubbies i love your faces thank you so much for keeping this disgusting disgusting garbage boat afloat i couldn't do without you and um yeah you complete me yes <laughs> no really you complete no, it, like, me i was agreeing yes yeah i just from your face it, it <laughs> couldn't tell that's just my face all the time oh jesus okay if you want to know where to get my wonderful halloween merch which is currently available until november 1st everything will be listed down in the description box below and uh yeah i guess i'll see you yeah. little pumpkins later yeah bye bye